Norman has a fever. Norman woke with a start. He felt anxious and his heart was beating quite quickly. Taking a few deep breaths Norman realized that he had woken from a nightmare. He tried to remember what he had been dreaming about, but the details seemed just out of reach of his conscious mind. There were quick flashes, but nothing solid that Norman could grasp. The apartment, his cat, a fire. Fire. Norman leapt out of bed and did a quick circuit of the small apartment, his heart racing now. Everything was fine, but Norman was hot, much hotter than usual, so hot that he was, in fact, sweating. Norman headed to the bathroom and opened the medicine cabinet. He took out the digital thermometer and sighed heavily. This could be it. The virus that was dominating the news and the reason why everyone was social distancing, Norman included. He slipped the thermometer under his tongue and waited tentatively for the results. It was Thursday morning and Norman had been working from home this week. He idly wondered what the process was for calling in sick when you weren't intending to go to the office anyway. He also considered the potential consequences should he have the virus and began to recount the people that he had recently been in contact with. The list wasn't long, but before Norman could finish the thermometer beeped. Feeling more than a little apprehensive, Norman lowered his eyes and read the small screen. It confirmed that he did, indeed, have a fever. He felt his anxiety levels rising again and headed back to the bedroom in search of Norman. The cat always had a calming influence on him, and it wouldn't do to add a full-blown panic attack to his already mounting troubles. Curled in a ball, the cat was still snoozing, oblivious to Norman's abrupt departure. Norman sank down onto the bed, reaching for his faithful friend. As he did, he noticed how warm the bed felt. Not warm, positively hot. Norman leaned over the side and saw that the light on the switch for his electric blanket was glowing red. He must have fallen asleep last night with the blanket on high. Switching the dial to the off position Norman reset the thermometer and popped it back in his mouth. He was feeling somewhat hopeful at the beep this time which turned to overwhelming relief when the display showed that his temperature was already returning to within the normal range. There was a big smile on Norman's face as he headed to the kitchen to start breakfast. He thought that he might email his work colleagues later, just to check in and see how they were doing. They might even laugh at the amusing story that he had to tell them. Norman mewed loudly at his feet, demanding his own breakfast. Despite the unfortunate false start, this could turn out to be a perfectly normal day after all. 